Right, so I think 3D printing should be used to solve problems. Uh, some toys are okay, some knickknacks are fine, but I'm more interested in solving problems with this thing. So, I had a problem. I have a Rolly Flex, and it did not have a lens cap. It's been sitting around for years, tons of dust all over the lenses. They seem to be okay though. But if I'm going to take it anywhere, try and shoot with it, I need some way to protect the lenses. So I did several variations until I finally got this. Now this I thought would be the final variation, but it turns out not so much. Now this, it's really nice. It goes on it. It can twist to the right and stay lock in place. I can untwist it, unlock it. It doesn't quite fit on the bottom one. It won't twist. And I can't actually have two because the space in here is too narrow. So I wouldn't be able to have one on each side and there's already not a lot of uh, material on the ends. Oh, come on, focus. Okay, there we go. There's not enough material on the ends already, so I didn't want to make them any thinner. And the printer has tolerances, so I can't really go much thinner than I already have. So I figured let's try doing one where they're together. And that's where this one came from. But bottom is just too thin. I had to make it thinner because of these parts here. They raise up. So I had to make that ridge thinner, but it's just too thin. Really, it can't hold on to anything. The top part can. So I can use this and does it is tight enough to where it'll snap into place but it's, it's just a uh, it's not quite right it does snap on and off but I, I don't feel like it would stay on reliably so now a few iterations later I have this one so this one I customized a bit I used two different colors of filaments. I started with white and ended uh, with blue to create this. Um, very much based on this design here. I, ah, there you go. I made the ridges on here slightly thicker and I offset the uh, twisting mechanism and brought them a little closer uh, to fit a little bit better. So if I line this up, it just snaps into place, twist it, it'll lock. And that thing, it's not super tight, it seems a little loose, but it's not coming off. It's going to protect those lenses. I can stick this on a bag, you know, it, in a bag it's not, it's not going to free and have anything happen to it to get it off I just lift slightly and twist and then it comes right off so this I had actually looked on I think it was on Thingiverse and found a really flex lens cap and it just did not didn't fit at all so this one custom made specific for the 3.5 Xenar and it fits great and if you're interested in the file let me know and I may share it but so far I'm pretty happy with this it took a lot of work uh, a lot of trial and error a whole lot of error I didn't show all the ones I threw out but I finally have one that works and is reliable and I can trust to stay on and protect those lenses uh, wherever I put it.